Our next competitor is 17 years of age. He will be a senior in high school this fall. He represents Monstro and the Warrior Factory. It is his third consecutive year on stage three. And he is the defending young adult National Ninja League world champion, hailing from Webster, New York. Give it up for Aiden Wood! Now, I like Aiden Wood a lot. He is an incredible young man and a phenomenal athlete, but I have a feeling if you asked a lot of people between the three defending champions in this division for the men, Caden, Aiden, and Joe, I feel like most people would say Caden would have the ability to get the farthest, and maybe Joe, but Aiden is the only one in stage three. Yeah, and Aiden has just consistently impressed me across all of his competitions this season. Just And in previous seasons as well. Mm -hmm. It is no, no doubt that he is one of the very, very top athletes in the elite division, proving as much today. Linking the tablets, knowing that at this point you're probably going to have to shave off time where you can. Straight through the paint track. I bet he goes right up to center court cliff as soon as he applies some more chalk. Already straight arming a little bit on the center court cliff. I'm worried, Mary. I, I'm not worried. He, with the way that he flew across that half, I think it might be more strategy for him than anything else. Well, he is gliding through the rest of it mm -hmm. after that. He also goes for the tap. But realistically, again, already four athletes have beaten this reverse grab. If you want to finish on the podium, you have to beat this reverse grab. Let's see what Aiden Wood can do. He oh, can't get no. it. And he was definitely gunning for the fastest time. You could see it. He was pushing himself through that first front half of the course, but unfortunately, that reverse grab.